Alright, so in today's video guys, I'm gonna show you how I work at home and how I manage my time and what are the activities, you know, the routine that I have on a daily, you know, while working at home, you know. So I have been working at home since March or end of March and up until today, it's already the 22nd of October I mean luckily I am still working at home so you know it's a lot manageable than working you know in the office because you know you have less preparation as you can see I'm just wearing like shorts and a t-shirt you know which is what I wore when I slept <laughs> so the moment you wake up you just wash your face you know and then turn on your computer and then prepare your coffee and everything you know so what i love about working from home is you know you don't get the chance to interact with people so less contact with people so you don't really worry about you know getting the virus wait a minute my boss is calling me now so this is what i'm talking about so we do meetings on in the morning Good morning. A few inches later. Okay, so we just finished the meeting actually I don't know if you can see the time-lapse that I shot because it's a little dark and I didn't know you know the footage until I, I looked at it and then see that oh okay because I thought the exposure or the, the brightness will change as soon as you know like I play it after shooting it but I guess it's not happening <laughs> anyway I'm gonna explain to you the, the situation here so I do have this, you know, this is from Ikea. This is where I put my laptop on. So to make it, you know, look like, or to make it, you know, there have some elevation whatsoever. And also this, also from Ikea. So what I do is I, like, this is like a, fa a cell phone stand. So I normally just put it here like that. So whenever I'm working, you know, I can see some notification on my phone while I am working okay so there uh, these are like cell phone cases like old ones for my phone that I will be giving to my friends and this uh, container is also my friends container that I will be returning because by the way guys there will be an event that I will be attending later on tonight so um, I will be bringing this actually we're just gonna have coffee or dinner or whatever but I'm gonna be bringing this so that they can use it because that's those are not mine and then these are like long overdue gift for my friends I hope they're gonna like the cases guys because it's stuck there in my cabinet for a long time anyway these two these two pillows I used them you know just to have like a throw pillow because I have this little couch so I don't want like if I have a friend coming over I don't want them to just feel a little cold you know I want them to feel warm and cozy so for the time being I'm using them like I just put them in the back and then I just you know lay on them like that just the two and then this pillow I use them I usually like put them on my I would say belly so that I can like a little bit like rest my arm while I'm typing because you know this is my desk and I moved it right here and sometimes it can get really tiring because my work is all about Excel, Microsoft Excel, so it can get really tiring to keep on typing, you know, so I just, you know, put them, you know, like, I'm gonna show you guys so you'll get understand, you understand, here, so I do it like that and then I do the typing, you know, and then this one, this is like a little, like a mini blanket, I got this off of ta -da, Emirates so I use this as a blanket I'll show you guys 
because you know the the air condition in our house is um, centralized so it can get really cold and you know you have to respect your roommate sometimes they always want to you know have the air condition on so I don't want to complain because uh, maybe they're sleeping and I'm working so we have to respect that so um, what I do is I just you know put on the blanket the pillows with me while I'm working so yeah that's why and I don't really like fix them I just put everything here because you know I'm just working at home, I'm not going anywhere, so when I wake up, I just, you know, grab them one by one whenever I need them and then that's it. I didn't really have a good sleep last night actually. I slept around 1 a.m. and uh, I woke up at around like 7.30 and my duty is starting from 8 and um, I didn't plan to vlog actually because I felt like I would be you know I would look so tired and you know maybe I will have a lot of tasks but so far after the meeting you know my boss is kind enough to tell us to just enjoy our weekend and just do whatever we can for the day so what I do pretty much is you know I work in a call center company or a telecommunications company but I don't really um, take calls you know um, I work in the back office meaning I do all the administrative work you know so pretty much you know admin work and I'm very happy because I have two days off and it's I'm, I'm not disturbed during these two days which is a great thing so sometimes I can go to Dubai or I can go to other cities during my off or I can like do whatever I want like you know shoot a video or clean my room you know so I live in a room in a single room without the bathroom because the bathroom is shared and also the kitchen so yeah this is my room and I have moved here in May and I'm very much satisfied because it looks very clean and it's huge room pretty much enough for all my stuff to you know to fit in honestly before moving here I never thought that I have a lot of things you know but when I started you know bringing the boxes I was pretty shocked like oh okay I don't know why but for Filipinos usually we hoard stuff even if they're old and uh, that's me <laughs> so anyway what I do now is um, I'm gonna be opening some files, like some worksheets, you know, and I'm gonna drink a glass of water and make my sandwich, which is a typical breakfast because I don't really eat heavy in the morning. I just eat, uh, I just eat anything so that, you know, I don't have to worry about drinking coffee right away because, you know, it's not good to have coffee immediately in the morning with an empty stomach so you really have to manage to eat something before drinking your coffee you know and I know coffee guys so those who are coffee lovers you know coffee is amazing in the morning you know so yeah we're gonna do that and then we're gonna start working and by the way uh, my plan today is I will not be cooking because um, I don't know I cooked so much actually last night and yesterday so maybe I will just order food from outside and also to save time you know because I don't know maybe I will have new tasks coming up so I just want to make sure that I do have enough time and not spend so much when it comes to preparing my lunch so yeah that's the plan guys I hope you're having an amazing day and please join me on this day as I work at home and enjoy the Thursday which is the last working day before the weekend starts so yeah I'll catch you guys later by the way guys, what I normally do when I wake up is I fix my bed which is still a mess and then I open this you know part of the window so that I'll tell you the reason why because I just need a little bit of light. I don't want to have the, the room light turned on. I just want to have like you know light out of my window and the reason for that is I don't want to, uh, what you call it, um, I don't want this to be enlightened, uh, the whole part of the table because this table for me is like, you know, a coffee table slash my cabinet slash my pantry. So I have everything there inside, you know, I don't want them to be, you know, reached by the sun rays. So I just, you know, I mean, when the, when this light, you know, reach this part, the end of the table, then I, I open the other curtain 
you know because i have like plants there actually and the other two you know those are like indoor plants that you know i always make sure that they get enough sunlight on a on a daily you know so here i'm gonna make my own coffee so i'm gonna use this mug i'm gonna make my coffee now so first i'm gonna get the coffee so like i said my little pantry so here is my coffee and the sugar and then the the creamer or the coffee meat yeah this is what i use guys just move there a little bit it's there so i just need to get my little spoon i put all the the dishes that i nearly washed there and then when they're dry then i move them to the to the covered one yeah so there you go i'm just gonna make my coffee there. All right, guys, so next is I'm going to fill in this electric kettle or kettle, whatever you call it. To those of you who are living in UAE, you guys can relate the need of having this water instead of, you know, drinking from tap water or like the huge container because this one has less sodium, which is beneficial because water here water here can get a little salty i have a mirror there guys <laughs> so yeah so i told you guys that i'm gonna be making my sandwich but i feel a little lazy today so i think i'll just get something here like cookies or biscuits there i'm a little embarrassed to show you guys what i have but this is what <laughs> some Filipino chips and biscuits everything so yeah I have the what you call it the, some tea there because I love having tea at night so yeah I let me just put this right here so I can arrange them there and I like to spray my plant like every oh okay I'm seeing new plants oh my god that is so amazing let me spray them wow you see that oh my god it's growing i can't believe it is happening now amazing there you go okay so it's about to boil so i like this so i don't have to go out of the kitchen and then boil water there you go, it's done. It's just like a minute or two. I'm just gonna pour it in. I think that's enough. Yeah. Can I have my biscuit here? A few inches later. Alright, so just to give you guys an update, the battery died on this camera, so I have to change them. So now I'm gonna need to charge the other ba the other battery because I have a spare one. I came prepared. <laughs> and also I finally opened the other curtain because um, you know it, it it already reached the edge of the coffee table, like I said earlier. And also this is to give more sunlight to the other two plants that i have there yeah and sometimes like afternoon um i normally just stand here and look at my bright window and then check what's going on outside you know back in the summertime there was like uh some sort of a fire and i thought it was just dark clouds and then it ended up you know i saw like in the news that it's not there was like a fire in my area so yeah that's one thing that I also noticed when I'm just looking up here. So this is my view here. So to my right, you know, that's my view. And then all the way here. And there's also like a building on the side. So yeah, it's a beautiful Thursday morning. I think it was, it's like 
24 degrees now so it's not that hot anymore it's, it's pretty nice so yeah anyway i'm gonna continue to um work and in a little bit after like an hour and a half i'm gonna order food because they are they, they don't actually take orders until like 11 so by 12 i can have my lunch here so which i will show you guys later on so yeah i hope you're having an amazing day could keep watching my video <laughs> A few moments later. So just an update guys. Um, I'm still working. You guys can see. And um, it's already 11 a.m. now. And I called the restaurant so they can deliver the food that I want to eat for my lunch. But uh, the guy said that he can only deliver around like 12.30 noon time. So I hope I can contain my hunger. <laughs> by that time because i'm not actually hungry now but i mean i just feel the need of having lunch you know that feeling guys i mean you are not hungry but it's already lunch time so you feel like you have to have something you know so yeah i'm just gonna wait for my food so i'll just update you guys so right now it's around 11:05 in the morning the guy said the food will come by 12 30 maximum i hope it comes early so that i can eat soon so yeah there's not so much update guys i didn't really do so much you know aside from working and while watching some videos so i can get that positive vibe while working so i don't get bored because you know i'm all alone nobody's here you know just doing the daily routine on a working day so yeah keep watching guys the food is there in the I need to put these things aside and I'm gonna go and break so here now okay so I'm gonna show you guys what I purchased this is actually a chicken rice meal take note guys in Arabic food or delivery food or the way they eat it is like they have this plastic there you go I mean you don't really need to use this but okay so you don't get dirty. I mean your table doesn't get dirty. Alright, so let me show you the food. So this is what I'm talking about. So this is the bone or beef bone soup and this is the tomato sauce and this is the vegetables that comes with it. Now, most of the Arabs when they're eating this food, they are eating it with hands but now i think i'm gonna eat it with spoon and fork because i still have work to do so i turn on the ac as well because it's a little hot now and uh yeah so here's the food here guys this is a chicken mud beef this is a long grain rice so anyway i'm gonna try to eat as much as i can because like i said i cannot normally finish this entire meal so i'm gonna try my best so yeah, so let's eat guys. This is again chicken mud beef. This is so good. So yeah, let's eat guys. Let's eat guys. Oh, it's so good. By the way guys, it's still really really hot. I mean the food. When it's delivered, it's not warm, it's hot. Which is a good thing. And by the way guys, this is not spicy at all. It has a strong Arabic aroma and taste, but it's not spicy at all. And the soup is irresistible. I mean you can have this without the soup, but the soup guys is also a blessing. I think I'm halfway there. So I'm done eating guys and Actually, I just finished half of it and I really didn't want to finish it because this is a lot for me and I finished the soup and the sauce. By the way, I'm gonna throw away the, the soup and the tomato sauce and I left the vegetables. So normally what I do is after eating this, I set this aside, cover it up again and then i'm just gonna let it sit there until it you know cools down and then later on after like an hour then i'll put it in the fridge 
so that I can eat it some other time. So yeah, I'm planning to eat this again most likely tomorrow the same time like during lunch time or maybe like tomorrow uh, for dinner. I don't know yet. Alright guys, um, continue watching. <laughs> Hey guys, so finally I'm done with my work. So time check it is now. I think it's like 4.10 or 4.15. And honestly, I still have my computer turned on because I am considering the fact that there might be some deadlines or my boss might need some help. So I am expecting that my boss will call me like in a few minutes, you know, and I think maximum will be an hour of extension. So I would say that I would settle down at 5 p.m. usually, you know, because if he doesn't need anything or any, if he doesn't require any help from me, then he would, I would just sometimes not hear any call or any text message. So, so far, I'm still waiting actually. So yeah, so I guess my work just ended. <laughs> Hopefully, so I'm just uh, you know relaxing here and try to look at the window. You know, I'm just gonna show you guys. So here's my view. There, there's people they are resting also. So let me tell you guys what I love about working from home. You know, let's just sit here and talk. I started working at home since March of this year or end of March this year. And pretty much exciting as it is, you know, like everybody's dreaming about this, you know. I thought that it's going to be a lot of job for the company to give us access, you know, to be able to do the same routine, you know, the same amount of hard work that you have to do at home. You know, virtually, I thought I didn't really believe that but eventually you know it it happened and you know look at me now up until this month october i'm still working at home you know so i just feel really blessed and happy about that because i couldn't imagine uh the benefit i didn't really see them coming you know so of course the difference is that you know you don't really have to like shower and get ready with your clothes you know the moment you wake up it's not that i'm not showering but you know my routine changed so much you know somebody's calling me hold on guys all right let me just answer this call and i'll get back to you guys i'm back by the way it was just my friend who was just asking about if i have any activities for tonight you know so i would really like to catch up with everybody like i don't really decline any invitation as long as i do not have any prior commitment you know because it's not good you know people likes to spend time with you and you know you have to you know give them the time that they want as well anyway where am i one of the challenges that we have here as foreigners in this country is like us walking out going to work and in in the area where i live and where my workplace is there's not so much shade you know and before leaving the office you know the gate beside the vicinity which is close to my house you know is like they are no longer allowing us to enter that gate so we have to like you know go around the building and you know get inside the main gate for some reason which was a bad thing for us you know because we have to walk a little bit far and like i said there's not so much shade so you're gonna be sweating a lot the moment you get into the office you know and my boss i think last month he asked me if i wanted to go back to the office and i said um i have no issue if i'm required to you know because he's already there you know he's been working there for i think for two to three months already and then he was complaining that during meetings he has to wear mask you know and the guard is like screaming at them telling them to like practice social distancing during meetings you know and i was asking like how do you eat your lunch you know how do you eat um or how do you like take a break and then have some snacks you know and have coffee and they said well you just have to eat on your desk you know and i said oh that will be horrible you know like i remember before that when i whenever i bring my food i normally like preheat them uh in the cafeteria before eating so if that's not gonna happen then you know if if you are a filipino you like to cook your food then you know it's not really nice to eat a cold lunch so i said oh that will be a challenge you know i was really expecting that he's gonna bring me back to the office you know but basing on how 
like he approached me about wanting me to go back to the office you know it was a kind of a joke like he was just trying to test me whether I want to join him there or not you know but luckily he would never really force me to uh, go back home I just said that you know it will be a challenge for me if I have to wear mask the whole day during meetings and at the same time like eating my lunch on my desk you know you wouldn't want to smell the Filipino like food that I bring because you know he's Pakistani so they kind of have their own food as well you know so it's not really that desirable at all I told him that and he finally agreed you know but yeah everybody is I think most of the people are enjoying working at home you know the only like major reason for others is that their weight you know like you really have to watch out for your eating habit you know because when you are at home everything is accessible you know like I said I used to have this coffee table here in front of me and this table usually it only has like what you call it like some containers you know napkins you know I don't really have like all these like snacks and bread and like jams you know I don't really have those but since I'm just normally stuck in this room then I would like to have everything in front of me so I can really save time whenever I need to grab some bite you know so yeah you just really have to watch out for your eating habit because it can be dangerous for your health you know to those of you who are trying to you know shed some pounds then it will be challenging for you guys you know even for me you know I started to gain a little bit of weight you know since working at home but luckily there were times that I'm like doing like skipping rope inside the room but not all the time but you know occasionally if I feel like I'm pretty much bloated you know then I do some skipping rope session all by myself you know with some good upbeat music you know what I mean so yeah I'm hoping that working at home will continue because it's also not that risky when it comes to you know um, interacting you know out and about you know because one of the things or one of the worries that I always have in mind is that what if I catch the virus you know because I'm out you know like even some there were times that even picking up groceries you know I, I, I'm still really really scared you know sometimes I just order them online you know so that will be you know less hassle and more convenient because you don't really have to be in contact with the people at the grocery store that's one of the things that I do practice and of course you know since I have a window Okay, there I have an alarm since I have like a huge window two windows actually lucky enough I normally like sit there as well um, during lunchtime just to get some sunlight you know because sometimes we need those and uh, yeah that's about it so what I'm planning today is instead of taking a nap which is my daily routine for an hour is I'm just gonna try to organize whatever I can before I head out and take a shower so yeah that's what I'm gonna try now so you know tomorrow which is Friday the weekend here I don't really have to worry so much about you know the stuff that I need to organize inside my room all right so I thank you very much for joining me in this vlog guys it's my first time vlogging you know covering everything and talking about what I do for a day and I hope you enjoyed this video if you have some questions just drop them on the comment section down below and please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and if you want to be the next one to know about my next upload then don't forget to hit the bell icon which is right beside the subscribe button so till next time guys bye So I'm gonna turn on the vacuum.